All right, done. You know what sucks in terms of making stuff? Gears. Because you've got to make it from wood to stone to blah, blah, blah. And it just sucks. All right, we have two electrical engines. All right, let's get rid of that. So sand is what it pumps out as sort of like a <coughs> thing. So you do not need it. Let's put the wood away. Put the steam away. Let's grab the saplings of desire, which are oak today. Four slots. That should keep it good. And it also pumps saplings out into the chest that we should probably grab now. And I don't have any more gold chests, I believe, but I do have an iron chest. Uh, so we'll just use one of them for uh, space reasons. All an iron chest is is a double chest, but it takes up one block. Um, uh, where, 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 oh, here comes the mouse thing. See, he's moving the other mouse. It works. While well, that one doesn't. I don't know what it is. I'll just have to probably install the drivers again. It's usually the uh, the way it works. All right, now. These engines are a bitch, because what they do is that. Now, I know I probably can't do that. Yeah, I need the Buildcraft wrench, because I believe that's a Buildcraft machine. I'm not entirely sure. I don't know it, but I think they are, which means we need the silver wrench, or the... What me calls it wrench? The one that isn't bronze, basically, and I'll put the bronze one back while I'm there. Which, I'll put it back half broken, but, you know, they break so easily. It's ridiculous. <clears throat> True test. Can I get in this time? There we go. Okay. This wrench is the one. And this doesn't break, I believe. So why does the bronze... Why does the bronze... <laughs> okay. <laughs> why does the bronze one break so easily? Don't know. I don't know. But it's quite annoying. And I'm guessing this is going to be a pretty lengthy episode. So, if you're watching this right now, what I've probably done is cut out making the uh, solar panels. Because that takes so bloody long. There you go. Can I have this back now? Because this needs to go under it. No, don't go up there. Come down here. Yeah, just notice how that branch doesn't break? Because it's cool like that. Alright. Now these, these uh, loggers and arboretums are not actually mine. I didn't make them. Whoops. These were ones that were originally made back at town. But I will make more of them and restock and put back what I took. It's just I didn't feel like making them. So I didn't make them. Hmm. Restricted pipe access. Machine set to a private. Did that do what this thing did over here? I feel zero MJ. All right, I'm obviously doing something wrong here. Um, either that, or there's just way too much pipe. These also, uh, the Arboretum and Logger also require a switch to, to be turned on, so let's try that first and make sure that uh, it's just because it's not on. But I do think I need a circuit. I do need a circuit. Damn it, I remember those things, and they took the, a basic circuit board is all you need, I believe, because that's the one I remember making. And of course... There is no recipe for it, you mother fudger. Um, Alright, I'm going to have to wiki this up, because there's no one on the server that can help me right now. Uh, so I'll be back when I get all that sorted. Alright, I have the recipe. I don't have the machine to make it, but, but there is one in town. You need two redstone and six ingots of tin. And you need a carpenter. Which doesn't make sense that you make an electronic circuit in something that suggests a wood maker. But anyway. 
So, uh, yeah, uh, there isn't a recipe for it currently in the NEI. But I'll show you how to make one now. You need two of them. Because the logger and arboretum both take one. I think that's the carbon. Nope. Uh, nope. Yep. Okay. Uh, we need a bucket of water to go there. And of course, I don't know. I think we need a bucket of water, do we? I think it was that. And that. I think. Okay, I'm not going to take any of them. I don't think they would work anyway. Uh, you need to left click and right click to get them out of there. We do need a bucket. Oh, please tell me there's a bucket in here somewhere. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'll keep that on me, just in case. Is there a bucket in here? Fuck a bucket. Alright, um. A bucket in there? Nope. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Because I'm so damn lazy. Can I have that in the right spot, please? I'm going to make two buckets here. I'm going to go and dump this in some water. Awesome. Put that back to avoid Ed getting blown up. Because apparently creepers target him and him only. Uh, which is usually the way to go. If you're watching this, and you know how to do this, you're going to know what I just did. Oh, come on! No matching recipe was found. Well, I'm obviously doing something wrong here. Oh, you did what? Oh my god, I bet, okay, I'm going to have to borrow this redstone, but I bet everybody watching this is just throwing their arm, yeah, there we go, fucker. Alright. I think. I don't know if that gives it to me, or if it takes time to build it. I don't, I don't know what's happening. More resources. Uh, oh. Oh, okay. All good. I know what's going on. Uh, but bottom line is I'm a dickhead, basically. It's the easiest thing to remember. So, do you need more tin? Or... You've got enough redstone. Can I have it now? Because I need two of them. I keep blipping up the uh, thing. I don't know if you can see that, but... Um, why can't I have that now? Does it take time, or...? I don't understand. I'll be back when I get this sorted. Alright, done. Uh, this was actually just glitched. All I did was just click that up there, believe it or not, and then it started to work. Alright. No, you can stop that now. I'll grab that back. You can keep that. Um, so, I've made four just in case something goes wrong and I, and I need to put... I'm literally not going to go in there anymore just because of the fucking doors. I missed my portable hole. Didn't need doors. Didn't even use them. But then something happened and blew someone up and then somebody got angry and said no more doors. Uh, understandable. 
I'm gonna, I'm going back to my Naga because that fucking thing is pissing me off. All right, sensitivity up a little bit. All right, basic circuit board. Kachow goes in there. If you saw what just happened then, that has to be a bug, because that's fucking stupid. It just, you only need one, but it just took them fucking all. As I had it in my mind that, oh yeah, I'll just right click, which is one, in there. Nah, fuck, fuck off. I'm get this is why I don't play with machines, because all the stupid shit pisses me off. And Jeb, if you don't fix that sprint glitch, I'm going to come over there and I'm going to shove something up your ass. Pisses me off. This is a bad day, people. Okay? Bad day. Now I've got to walk through these fucking doors of doom. And I ain't playing with Thomcraft for fucking two years just to get it, so... See? That happens. And that stayed like that. Just give me that. See if I can get the sprint. Look at this. That's a sprint glitch. Try getting that when you're running away from a creeper. Uh, uh. Right. Get the fucking switches while I'm here. Bad day, people. Bad day. I really need to change the DPI on this mouse to 1200. This is just way too low. Alright. That has four circuit boards in it, because apparently it makes itself feel special. Right. Now, let's get top side. Top side, I said. Okay, fuck it, that's going to piss me off. Get your switches. Ciao, ka ciao. Now that should have power. We have power. Okay. Yep. Now, I think the problem with this bit is it doesn't have room. I think torches technically take up a block, so it's going to sit down. It's going to be like, no, can't build it. You have your hummus. You have your saplings. Can't put sand in there, so you don't need it. I think that's everything. And now, technically, yep. Okay. We're in business, ladies. Epic. Those electrical engines will maintain themselves. Let's check the bat box drainage. Practically fuck and all. Alright, this is going good. Now, do we have enough room? Man, that thing's big. That's what she said, but you know what I mean. <clears throat> Alright. I'll block that off when I get another piece of cobblestone. Hopefully. Now, to get... Okay. Yeah, we should have enough room. Hopefully on that side too. If not, I'll have to... Because once the hummus goes over this block, which it shouldn't, that should be enough. It should be enough room. Uh, I don't know if they're going to blow up. I don't know anything about electrical engines, apart from they need an annoying circuit board to work. But uh, hopefully we have enough room to the point where the hummus will not come over the uh, solar panels. Because if they do, that'll piss me off. Because I'll then have to move that entire arrangement. Just because this thing is so friggin' massive. You know what? I think it'll literally stop right there. Hopefully I'm that lucky. Okay, it's going to stop here. Right, uh, epic. Uh, yeah, uh, what you'll notice is, if you don't have anything for the blocks it cuts to go anywhere, it's just going to spew them out. Just put a box there. Literally. That's it. Uh, and then if you want any, if you want, like I'm pretty much going to set that up off screen. All you do is get a redstone engine. <clears throat> you have it 
say you put the extraction pipe here, run it down, you'll want the redstone pipe, uh, redstone engine there. And that'll pump it out of the box down through the pipes. Alright, we are in business. That's fully complete. <clears throat> With the Arboretum, what you'll need to do is you'll need to maintain... I don't think you'll need to maintain the hummus, but you will need to take out the sand that it eventually builds up. Um, and it doesn't take long. <clears throat> so it looks like we are done, peoples. We are done. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to dig this out. And uh, make a quick little staircase for ease of access. Like so. So I can get to and from this easily. And the pipe. Yep, pipe will come down here. Uh, I'll probably run it across there, down there, uh, into the walls of the storeroom, storage room, behind the boxes, so I don't have to look at it. Any look at it, and that'll just continually pump out. I'll dig out an area behind the walls so I can get in there and maneuver around, uh, so I can, you know, change the destination, uh, and then whenever you're not using this, just flick it off. But apparently, uh, that's working pretty good. Now, to get items f just from this, I'm not entirely sure how you do that. I think all you just do is just hook a pipe up to it, as if you would the box. Uh, so, that's what I might end up doing in the first place, but it's a good idea just to have a box here, and then have a diamond pipe as your first pipe, so then you can control what goes where. Um, if you don't want the saplings, but it's a good idea to keep them. Because, again, you, I think you can also use them in biomass production. Not too sure. Never used it, never looked at it. Um, but saplings are good because you can also burn them. So if you get, like, a really big supply stock of uh, oak saplings or any saplings that you're never going to use, um, a massive of them, whack them in a furnace. You know what I mean? Use them up. Because you can use them as coal. I think one sapling is half a burn. So two saplings is a burn. Um, obviously it's not as good as a blaze rod. Uh, one blaze rod is 12 burns. One coal is 8. And then it just goes downhill from there. To the point where you're just better off using one chunk. Uh, what I want this to do is hurry up and bloody grow one so I can show you what happens. Um... But I think you get the gist of it. It cuts it down, throws it in the box. Awesome. So guys, that's going to conclude this episode of A Bit of Rage. Exploration. In terms of what it takes to piss me off, which isn't much. Um, so yeah. That's that. I'll get that built. I'll get... Uh, I'm basically going to duplicate what I just did here, up there. Um... But instead of it going from a, that box, it's going to go to an MFE, and then it's going to go to a LV transformer or something like that. But that is putting out quite a lot of power. So I'm happy with that. Thank God we didn't have Greg Tech, because if we didn't, it, uh, if this server had Greg Tech, I can tell you I would have rage quitted it a long time ago, just because of the sheer stupidity of Greg Tech. Like to make one solar panel is just hell on earth. No, I pushed the wrong button. I went into full screen mode. So, that's what happened with that. Oh, hang on. Now we can check how much these electrical engines actually use when it's running straight from the bat box and not from the solar panels. So, when that sun goes down, we see how much exactly they use. Energy, current output to store... Oh, it's actually storing it to a point. Heat. Okay, heat's actually going up. Do they pop? I don't know what they do. But I hope they don't blow up. Oh shit, that one's red. Hmm. 
What's this thing here? I don't know what this is. I don't know anything about these engines. Alright, here we go. Should be night time now. Yep. Okay, so it's basically in the night, I'm thinking. During the night, that might actually get drained to zero. I think. But uh, that's, you know, it doesn't really matter. This thing's just meant to be something that constantly works, basically. Uh, it doesn't matter if it works not during the night. It doesn't work during the night, but, you know, who cares. Alright, guys. That's this episode. Take care and see you in the next one. Uh, sorry about that. Not cutting there. Uh, just a quick thing. This is how you make hummus. Okay? You're better off using fertilizer. All fertilizer is is sand and appetite. Uh, or sand... I don't know what that is. Sand and appetite. Or if you want... Oh, compost. I thought that was... Uh, Oh, okay. Yep, you're better off doing that. Bit of wheat, bit of dirt. Everyone's got that, especially me. That, that. That makes eight. There you go, guys. See ya!